fixing the not enough power error message. Don here from 3BR Power Sports. I want to talk today about the GoPro error message, not enough power. We've got our GoPro Hero 12 camera and we've equipped it with a 3BR Power Sports X Power H9 external power kit that will allow you to record as long as you have memory. We have taken the battery out of the camera, so we'll be recording just on this external power alone. So we turn the camera on. And get the dreaded not enough power message. So what do we do about it? Well, let's have a look. Fix is a two-step process. First, you're going to need to upgrade the firmware in your camera using a special version of firmware from GoPro Labs. Then once that's done, you need to load a app on your smartphone called QR Control. This app has all of the features, extensions, and add-ons of GoPro Labs that you can use in your camera. We're looking for a particular one called TUSB, Trust USB. Here's how you do it. You want to go to your browser and search for GoPro Labs. And here we are. This is actually the GoPro website, but GoPro Labs is a part of the GoPro company. So just click on Try It Now and it'll take it to the GoPro Labs webpage. Now you see a whole list of cameras for which they provide the GoPro Labs special firmware. We're going to be dealing with the Hero 12 Black. And you just click on it and it will start to download. Now, I have already downloaded the file and it's this zip file right here. Now you're gonna to wanna to unzip that and you'll find that there is a folder called update. And this is what you're looking for to update the camera. Once you have that update folder, you're going to want to copy that folder to your micro SD card that's going to go in the camera. Okay, got my Hero 12, has the battery in it, it's fully charged. Put my micro SD card that has that update file in it, turn on the camera, and it automatically starts the update. There you go, update complete. Now the camera will restart. And it shows that the GoPro firmware is installed. Adding the GoPro Labs feature that will fix the not enough power message. Okay, we are looking for an app called QR Control. So go to your app store and search on QR Control. And there it is. Obviously, I already have it loaded. So all I need to do to open it and it comes up and you'll see that there are several tabs, but extras is where we want to be. So you can scroll up and down this until you find TUSB. Input data is one. Make sure it's permanent. And that brings up a QR code that you just point your camera at and it will automatically load this feature. Now the next step is to load the application from that QR control on the phone that we just downloaded. All right, so here we have our phone set up with the QR control. We have our TUSB QR code there and all we do is point the camera at it and as quick as that, it loads it. It's all done. We can confirm that the TUSB firmware feature has loaded just by turning the camera on. And there you go, feature activated TUSB, GoPro Labs firmware, so we're good to go.